No, <laughs> oh, you gotta say something else you thought about. Wait, where are you? Oh. Grab a water jug and let's load up in the car, in the van. Yeah. Come on, right here. Those water jugs, right there. These water jugs. They're empty, just take it to the van, we gotta fill them up. Where are we gonna go after that? Uh, maybe get some groceries. Mia, are you gonna grab a water jug for us, baby? All right, here's the only one that's left. You got too much Smarties, make your tongue bleed. Yeah, that stinks. But I do wanna show a more optimistic, uh, ex let me, my vlog is going to start looking more excited, a little more curated, a little more positive than it had been. Um, which is not all my life is, and it's not the only thing that's real about my life by any stretch. Have you guys seen this TED talk, very popular, about body language? I tell people about this, that our bodies change our minds and our minds can change our behavior and our behavior can change our outcomes. They say to me, I don't, it feels fake, right? So I said fake it till you make it. Like, I don't, it's not me. Like, I don't want to get there and then still feel like a fraud. I don't want to feel like an imposter. I don't want to get there only to feel like I'm not supposed to be here. You're just going to do it and do it and do it, even if you're terrified and just paralyzed and having an out-of-body experience until you have this moment where you say, oh my gosh, I'm doing it. Like, I have become this. I am actually doing this. Don't fake it till you make it. Fake it till you become it. You know, it's not do it enough until you actually become it and internalize. By pretending to be a thing, we become that thing. So, um, not that I have to pretend to be excited or optimistic or whatever, but I wanna lean into that part of my life and, and who I am in that way more in the vlog because I think it's, it's, I think there's just more value there. I'm not gonna stop being real about life is hard. Kids, get in the car, please in the car but life is also beautiful and we got to show that too why does this upset you so much just let him say crazy things it's part of being four years old okay thank you very much mia yours No, just stay there, Kai Kai. What do I want to say? Daddy, Mina finished my homework today. Alright, well get home so you can finish it. It spilled. One of them spilled? Yeah. What is in it? What's leaking? It's like... It was the water jug. It's almost completely empty. Not gonna let that get me down. It's a beautiful day. Life happens. It is real. It is going to... Uh, it's gonna give you things you don't want, things you don't expect. Nah, this is good. Life is good. We're gonna take that beautiful moment of spilled water all over the van. No complaints, no complaints. We're good, we are good. If I sound a little desperate, it's because I'm really trying to convince myself, right? We, we, we really are good, we are really, we're grateful for, we're grateful for the moment. It might take a little bit extra work sometimes to be okay with the moment, to be good, to be living our best life doesn't mean that it's not totally worth it and that we're not getting it done anyways. Beautiful. <sighs> Best part of the day being with my family. Oh, I love you so much.
Sweet little hugs like that are definitely a really good reason to be able to squat until you're really old. Ah, oh, they're so precious. Gotta be able to move to do it though. It was my new dress for my birthday with the big sparkly golden heart. Mm -hmm. But I couldn't find it, so I just wanted to do this. Two skirts. All right. Have a good day at school. Okay. Have a great day, girls. The reason that you're getting so many meals and meal prep in my vlogs is because I am trying to eat healthier and there's some accountability that just comes from showing what I'm eating. That does not mean that everything that I cook and show is actually going to be like a healthy balanced meal. It's just a general trend. Take it for what it's worth. It's not like a hard and fat. Don't, we're okay, we're okay. Does anybody have that problem where anytime they cook anything on their stove, their fire alarm goes off, just beep, beep. Ah, oh, man, you know what? Neither do I, not anymore. Plug in the old fan, point it directly at the old fire detector. It's not a problem anymore, not a problem. Cook away, my friends, cook away. All right, man. We got game day today, Red Sox, Yankees. You gonna watch? Is this, is this a thing on your radar? Playoffs, big times. Are we gonna best something? What's happening here, man? What is happening? The last thing I wanna leave you with is this. Tiny tweaks can lead to big changes.